50s or you just gotta mix the ever living yep. hell out of him. Yep. And usually he never allows his opponent to kind of just play the game. He forces them to play their game or makes them just struggle and struggle to slow it down. And against Pac-Man, you would think you can't really play aggressive like this. As you can see, Gatsby opening up very phenomenally, almost looking to end it off that downer as well, but Keely just coming out for the trampoline. Yeah, he's definitely started it off hot. Like you said, aggressive, aggressive player. But Kiwi is fine with playing that aggressive game. A lot of players will say about Kiwi, she is a surprisingly in-your-face Pac-Man. Like, she's okay playing against your Falcons, your Falcos, your Foxes. We're not Fox, but we'll talk about that another time. Honestly, that's a very solid way to play because Pac-Man has some phenomenal frame data yeah. that he can pretty much use to just get in those scrapping situations. I think, pretty solid brawling options, and not to mention those fruits. I think the Smash Twitter, like, understanding of Pac-Man is like, this character camps you, she's just gonna throw Hydrant and can't buy the Hydrant. And uh, what they don't understand is that uh, Pac-Man is an amazing brawler, too. Like, he can get in your face just like Kiwi is doing right now and gets the bell confirmed to take stock one. Yeah, that's that Taco Bell. It's that gong gong ring. Right <laughs> that Taco is so Bell. That's so disrespectful. What do you mean what it's you, disrespectful? You, why, why, would you want a why would you want Taco Bell in your character? Taco Bell is disgusting. I don't know. I know I just made so many people just mad by listen, saying that sentence, but it is gross. I okay? normally don't if listen. If you eat a Taco Bell, you're gross. I'm going to say it. I don't eat a Taco Bell, but the only thing I like from Taco Bell is those adobo fries. I'm a sucker for those adobo I've fries. No, I, I don't, they're not exactly called adobo fries, but they're like they're like uh, nacho fries. That's what they call them. They call okay. them nacho fries. Okay. And they're as we hard. went as we went on a long tangent about Taco Bell, Kiwi is just destroying Gatsby right now. Oh. Absolutely no chance. She knew she was go he was going to jump. He didn't even know he was going to jump till he jumped right into it. Insane stuff from Kiwi right now. Yes, yeah, that vitamin C. And right now, eating some Galaga combos to try to extend off the platform. Ooh, just trying to knock her down all the way. All the, right. The thing with getting an amazing confirm off the stage like that, against most characters, you would be in an edge guard situation. But this is Pac-Man, one of the best recoveries in the game. Kiwi doesn't care if you hit her off the stage for 30%. She'll always get back. And I'm really liking how Kiwi's utilizing that fruit and Pac-Man's frame out to kind of just wall it out. The Hydrant, we haven't seen too much of the Hydrant into play, yeah, but exactly. these like, cherries, these like fruits. I, like I said, aggressive. Pac-Man. Um, Gatsby going off stage against Pac-Man. What do you think about that strategy? Gatsby. Do you agree with that? It's a 50-50. It's a 50-50 between Gatsby dying. It's a 50-50 of you dying. Oh, and he won the 50-50 right there. He flipped a coin. He called heads, and it was heads. Because the thing that you got to know about Gatsby, Gatsby is a gambler. And he definitely gambled running into that bell. <laughs> he saw bell and was like, there's no, there's no way, like she, the there's no like way the she grabs Bell and just instantly throws it, right? There's no way. No shot. Ding, way. ding, ding. Way. All right, game two, game way. two. There's the Bell. Next round, next <laughs> round, move it out. Yeah, that. Yeah, just like in boxing. Ding. <laughs> just like in boxing. And um, yeah, it was pretty, it was pretty convincing from Kiwi there. Like Pretty convincing indeed, like, I'd say. Gatsby started off the, uh, the match hot, and as soon as Kiwi realized that, she was like, okay, I'm getting aggressive. I'm gonna get in your face too, okay? This is how you wanna play. Bro, who just starts off the match with that dash attack from Pac-Man? Well, I guess the- uh, And it Kiwi works. Does. Listen, that dash attack is mad good. It crosses up on no, shield, and it's really no, hard to punish. No, no, get out of here. Really? That move sucks. That's, I've seen that's insane! I've seen T use that move like twice ever. That's how you know that move sucks. If the best player of your character is not using the move, it's a bad move. Just admit yeah, it. Need more T-Bots, but taking away the trampoline, Kiwi going down. And I wanted to say real quick that this is one of Gatsby's favorite stages. Yep. He loves playing on the stage right now. But it can also be good for Pac-Man because Pac-Man uh, can benefit from uh, the really huge blast zones. Mm -hmm. um, uh, not the heaviest character in the world, but if you can't find your kill confirms as uh, Falcon, it can be really annoying to get kills. Yeah, and Gatsby really loves utilizing the platforms, and we're going to be seeing a lot of wall jumps coming, kind of coming into play. Wall jumps are so cool. That's how we got the, the trampoline yeah. to take out Kiwi, right? This is why I'm very like wary of going to stages like this yeah. where characters have wall jumps. It just gives them another layer of mix-up that you have to be ready for. Yeah, Kiwi just, Ki she just didn't know. You got to assume she just didn't know about the Gatsby wall jumps. Does she know? The infamous 
<laughs> okay, evading the orange this time around. No vitamin C dosage here. <laughs> no, no. no vitamin C. Gotta gotta find that somewhere else. <laughs> Not today. Fal well, Fal Falcon's definitely Falcon's somewhere drinking here. straight milk. <laughs> this man's a milkman. Yep. He needs. To, he, he's getting protein. Those pack pellets consuming him. All right, oh. up air bridge all the way across the way. But Kiwi clapping back immediately with the double fair and trying to set up shop with the hydrant as well. Ooh. Gatsby just not letting her breathe yeah. right now. She could not land right now, and that is not something you say of Pac-Man players very often. Usually they don't have a hard time getting down, but Gatsby was making it incredibly hard right there. Yeah, they are playing pretty evenly right now. It's just a huge, huge back and forth as Gatsby finds the opportunity to kind of just sit up in the corner right now to potentially get the stock, but we know that Kiwi has that belt around the corner, that fruit gun, she yep. has it on lock. Yep, and I believe she just picked the bell. Uh oh Wow, calls out the shield right there with the up B, but it's not going to do it because we are on Kalos. Oh my god, the the riskiest up B of all time. I think Wow, okay. Okay, I've made the decision. I think that yes. going off stage has been a net positive so far for Gatsby. It Even usually is because people are fearful. Yeah. That's when you put the fear. Like when you are literally in their vicinity, it threatens so many options. And yeah. they, it forces them to kind of think in their mind where they they may not be ready for it. It's almost like you're suffering from success as a Pac-Man player because you're not expecting people to have a game plan for your recovery, right? Uh -oh. They usually just respect it, right? And uh, Gatsby actually has a game plan. Knows how, to, knows how to edge guard this player. Probably has played Sinji a couple times and uh, is doing wonderfully so far. Right now, Gatsby going for toe for toe right now with Kiwi. There's the down air. Stop it down, but Pack Bell. That's oh not going to do it, especially nope. on Kalos. Yeah, and especially um, upwards uh, uh, up smash because uh, Falcon's really heavy. And, uh, like, you know, it's harder to get, um, depending on your fastball speed, up and down is like you live longer, depending on your fastball speed. That might be misinformation. I might be spreading this. Who knows? Are we spreading this information? That, that's the thing in melee. But as I was saying it, I was like, "Is that this game?" <laughs> oh, this is not good. The Falcon kick. She didn't know what to do. She was stun locked. Oh, that's what she wanted to do earlier, but she just couldn't find it. And uh, Gatsby loses out there. So close in that game too. Gatsby almost had it, but Kiwi coming out on top with the composure, kind of just not really jumping.